Got the fist bump. Wait, we has are he good. just gone Belmont all tonight? I guess he has gone. Uh, I think solo Belmont. I think. I think so. That's actually super crazy. But I mean, good for him. You know, Ness is uh, Ness is fun, but sometimes you want to switch it up a little bit. I love seeing like the character diversity. Yeah. Like you see Cloud, Little Mac. Yeah, a very uncharacteristic yeah. week for the cave. Uh, it's been kind of kind of crazy. I mean. Whenever, whenever I play here, I don't feel like I play like only Wolf or only Lucina or something. It's right. Like this is yeah. Game. This is kind of weird. This is this is very strange. You're right. All right. So Zeph's got limit now. He's sitting sitting zero at 95 percent and that hard shield pressure. But Zerum's gonna up be right out of it. Okay. Knows his invincibility frame. Zephyr holding there just through the axe, so he doesn't get hit through stage. Nice spacing right around it. Whoa. Ooh. Okay, so parries that uh, that neutral beat. Oh, I like that jump air dodge to get back on. Yeah. That's good. And the limit's almost back online. What's he going to do with it? Um, he's going to go for some down throw? No, he just mashes out. Okay, okay so the back. The forward air. Well, not, sorry, back air. The back air definitely helping him out there. And now he has limit. Lots of percents if he can get that neutral beat, but he doesn't. He just threw the blade, man. Oh, man, that F tilt. Okay. Zeph having to uh, definitely watch out for those axes as they uh, cover the ledge. I like that. He's moving really nice. Like, he is. that little, like, charge of limit for a second is, like, very cool. Yeah. I do like it how he just runs back. It's almost like, you know, how they used to do run up shield in, uh, in Smash 4, but now it's run away limit. Yeah, you, you really can't camp like this, guy. Yeah. Oh, my oh, God. No. Probably That's good. tough, yeah. He's No, he's got the limit. No, he had limit, and so he goes for the up. He gets back. The oh. only way he could have lived, but he still dies anyway. That's that's unfortunate. Okay. Whoa, pushing pushing Zero on his shield. Oh. He said no projectiles get cross-slashed. Zeph is staying so aggressive right up in Zero's face. And it's so good not letting him get the distance to get those uh, get those projectiles off. That's a nice up right, If he can kill Zero now, he'll be at a pretty big advantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh but no. he neutral bees the wrong way. No! Okay, he's going to recharge that limit and get something else. Okay, wow, that angles. Those angles, man. Zero, I'm kind of nice with those angles on those aerials. Getting past. It. Okay, so we just edge a Ooh. little bit forward. I like that you inch up just a little bit at a time and go for those projectile clangs. Zero, I'm on the the war, bro. He knew he would jump. Yeah. Okay, falling with a nair. That was almost good, but Zeph catches him with the up smash anyway. A little bit of hesitation from Zero was not what he needed right there. He needed to be ready to act out of that falling nair. Uh, you do not want to be at the ledge of the bell. No, you do not. And you don't want to be, especially with the cloud limit. Oh. Come on, he's going to go for that cross slash. No, that was a... Move, man. I know. He's, he's doing some dash dancing just to just to make Zerum drop shield for half a second. Gets the neutral B this time. Gets the down tilt and the up air. Uh, oh, my God. Yeah, Zephyr's playing really nice. Yeah, Zephyr played really nice that last 30 seconds alone. So literally just read that down tilt off of the ledge into the up air and then forced him to go into the down air so he could go for the charge F smash. Super smart. Super smart. Wow. Okay, Zephyr playing nice. Yeah. Alright. Has to pull out the nest now. Nest time. This, this should time. be best of oh wait, actually, is this best of five? This is best of oh. five. We are still in the best of five, uh the best of five plays. So he has the room to play around with, but obviously Zephyr sitting 1-0 right now over Zerom. Zerom now switching characters, going to back to PS2. This is going to be interesting. I feel like this is going to be much better for Zerom. It is, um, if anything, just because of the um, the comfort. Yeah, not only that, but Ness's ability to edge guard Cloud is just going to be so good. Like if he just holds the yo-yo, it's going to kill Cloud. Absolutely, and I'm wondering if he, you know, knows the knows the Belmont Cloud matchup, um, but he definitely knows this one. So it doesn't even matter. Okay, that limit. He's holding on to it. He's really making making uh, Zerum work for it. Nice down B is so cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Finally has to let go of it. 
Not a whole lot of punishability on that one, though. Ooh. Yo, Zero Smash mashes have been, like, impeccable. Absolutely. No, he's got good mash. Um, you know, he plays against Wadi all the time. You gotta, you gotta learn to mash against Wadi, you know what I'm saying? Okay, trying to space some back airs right now. Uh, obviously, he's not at kill percent, but it's it's worth to get the percents uh, just to set up for a future yeah. one, you know? No, Zero Arm is really, like, moving right now. Like, right. what happens is I'll beat him, like, or down beat him. Oh, okay, oh, that's, sorry, yeah, that's tough. So that time, Zephyr got caught by some cheese. You know, the tail of the PK Thunder will put him in a bad place and get caught with that up smash. Just a rough time. Yeah, because uh, before with Belmont, he was really having to rely on, like, trapping him at the ledge. Right. Know? Zephyr was just getting passive, but now he can actually just ledge. Right, exactly. You can just go for the same stuff. Like, the yo-yo on ledge is super strong against uh, against Cloud. He barely avoided that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see Zephyr thinking about contesting Ness offstage, but think, thought better of it and got back on. and was like, ah, I'll just charge limit more. Okay, he's going to go for another up air, but this time, wow, Zero, let it, let it rip. Oh, oh, he wants that. Yeah, he wanted that PK rocket. He loves going for that cheese. The okay, that traded. Interesting. Whoa, oh. no, the SD. No, no, I hate to see it. You didn't really have it. options there, even if he recovered correctly. I like, mean, yeah, but you still get pine. Oh my I mean, god, no, just the space. The drag down. Oh, oh okay. So they look at look at look at look at each other. They look at each other like, ah, you cheeky, you cheeky. I like that, but it, it'd be like that. Like what he did right before that was crazy. Though. Yeah, it it'd be, with like a PK it'd be fire that. diagonally into it, like a dragon up air into a grab. Like, right. That was easy. Okay. Okay. No, Zeron has a big lead. Like he doesn't care. Uh, right, a lead, but this limit could neutralize that lead. Oh, Just like that, almost gonna kill. Just barely not enough. And now if he is already a third of the way to limit. He just has to stay alive and, and you know play super safe. Play very optimally, but this is not the way you do it. That's it, that's it. You get caught by the PK Thunder and you get gimped. And that's Cloud, man. That's Cloud. This is why Ness was the pick. You know, it's like that PK Thunder is almost just a brain dead edge guard. All you have to do is throw it out, loop it around a couple of times, catches him eventually. He just gets that. He just gets to go for it. Yeah. At like at like whatever percent. Doesn't even matter. The one thing I'd say is he had he had to make sure he hit him with the tail. Yeah. If he hit him with the actual PK Thunder itself, it right? Would, it's so a launcher, off. right? Yeah. That's the launcher. Although at that percent, like you could launch him too. Like I mean, yeah. that helps. You know, it's like whatever. You set it for another one. It doesn't really matter. But it, then it gives him the opportunity to recover high. You don't want to do that. So. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what happens here on Yoshi's story. I don't know all the specifics of the Ness Cloud matchup, but I just right. know that Ness getting Cloud off stage, he's gonna basically kill him. Yeah. For sure, for sure. Okay, so wow, fading away with the fair and catching him just a little bit. A little bit of a cheekier uh, PK Thunder yet again. And Zero loves going for PK Thunder nonsense, shenanigans on triplats. I've always noticed that he loves these triplats so he can just do stuff. So I don't know. Zephyr going to this stage, um, I don't know if that's no, the, the move. movement with the down B is a little bit. Right. I think the slants are really going to help Zephyr in this one, though. He's got the limit. Let's see if it helps. Yeah, he had to shoot it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zerum will then go for the PK Rocket just to get himself closer to Zephyr. He's using a lot of that. Yeah. <laughs> he is. You're right. Okay, the magnet to reposition yourself and uh, change up your direction. So you reverse magnet? Yeah, so you can be reverse magnet to change your direction yeah. so you can go for a different area. You can actually combo people with that. Too. Exactly. Like, I've seen people go from, <laughs> like, magnet into reverse magnet into something else. It's crazy. Back air. Back air. Yeah, that's right. All right. Zephyr now has to get this kill pretty quickly before he takes on too much damage to be, uh, be worth it. Not the best trade for him. His wow, that... Was hitting him. Yeah, from the other side, and I just don't even know what to say about that. Poked him with it. That's the Zerum special. You know, Zerum loves doing that. That uh, that PK flash edge uh, reverse edge guard. <laughs> he punished with the F. So. Yeah, and so he actually gets the upper out of that. Wow. Okay, finally gets the kill. Fifty-four percent. That's actually not that bad. Whoa. This time the PK. Uh, okay. These platforms not really helping Zerum with uh, the PK thunder. Um. Whoa. Freeze frame. It's like record scratch. Yeah, You're probably he, wondering how I got into this situation. Yeah. If he didn't do that, he was just going to take a lot more damage. Oh, absolutely. 
Okay, shields that. If that had hit. Man, but that did. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Loops around for the uh, the Klim Hazard down low. I like that. Oh, he tried to go grab him. Okay, Ooh. yeah, there's the reverse magnet. Yo, he baited him so hard. He spammed, like, several back airs, and then when he never tried to punish it, he just did a down B instead. Yeah, I mean, the hitbox on that is great. At, you know, not a lot of uh, hit stuns, so it kind of just pops him down and makes him land so you can hit him real quick. They usually aren't expecting to act that quickly out of it. Okay, this time another down tilt. Great at catching that hesitation on ledge from Zerum. Zephyr needs to be a little bit more proactive with that kind of stuff, and he can get a lot more off of it. It's how he strings those together that's the real key. Nice. Yeah, that dash attack really had to stuff him out because Zephyr was ooh, mixing up his movement. Oh, oh the PK flash. Another up air. Yeah, Another PK flash. Wow, Zero so patient. Didn't even do anything. Just like wait. <laughs> just down being to air dodge the stage. Yeah, yeah, and I'm wondering. Oh, yeah, Zephyr's gonna go kind of deep, but Zero going far enough away that he knows Zephyr can't chase after him. Oop! Didn't actually help him. The, 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 the stinky leg helping him just a little bit. He's getting out of here. Okay, this time a lot of shield pressure though. Getting caught with a back air after all. Zephyr wants it. He's at 80%. He's almost to limit. Maybe about a third of the way left. And then you're good. And then you might be able to make some magic happen. As long as he gets some good aerials in the meantime. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Zero now. Uh, trying to fish for the kill a little bit. Okay. I like the, the, the crouch into down tilt. Oh no, the raw up smash. I respect it, but it put him in a bad place. Gonna have to use that limit to get back. And now he, ha he has to really respect Ness's grab now. He does. Yep. Oh my god, the back throw. Yep. Wait, hey, yeah. Did I not just say he had to respect Ness's grab? He did. Just saying. You did. I mean, that's the commentator's curse, baby. You know? The prophecy. The prophecy will be fulfilled. Ness will back throw at least some point in the set. Like, yeah, right you, after you know it, Ness. It. Yeah, you know it. Right after you say it, it's true. <laughs> Yeah, let's go to Delfino. Okay, Delfino Plaza. That is the counter pick. The stage can <laughs> Remember, Delfino Plaza. If you gentlemen do it, I guess it's legal. Ness isn't fun for everyone. That is true. I won't lie. You're not wrong. Ness is not fun for everyone. But it is fun for Zerum, and if it wins, that's fun, right? I Winning is fun. I honestly think watching Ness is hype only because his down B movement is insane. Right, and you can do crazy stuff like, yeah. well, like what Zerum does. Like, Zerum is the hypest, is the hypest Ness player you'll ever watch. This is the only way you'll ever get hype off of Ness. Like, ever. Ah. Oh my god, he's really cheesing him. Oh my god, the cheese. Oh, oh that was actually crazy. What? <laughs> what? Okay, no, I don't know how that did hit. Or just links to the okay, they're finally they're like <laughs> and Ooh, that Serum says and we're even percent. That's so funny. It's like, yep, that is how that works. Cloud baby. Okay, reversing. Wow, the last part of that up smash helping him out. Okay, rolling right into the cross slash. Now it's all about that PK Thunder cheese. Another up smash. I, I see the platforms helping him a little bit. Oh, he absorbed it, that was nice. Yeah, yeah look at the movement though, like. Yeah, I I know, like Ness Ness is, can move, but I mean I I don't usually don't see clouds move like that. Usually Cloud is like a whiff punish, not so much an aggressive uh, play or character, but you know Zephyr plays very aggressive, so it, it can happen. It can work. Whoa, Tessa didn't. Uh, yeah, that is untackable. You're right. Saw the red sparks. That's it. Okay, there's the launcher. Okay, really trading with a down air. Okay, I like that. Not even trading, just just uh, invalidating. Uh, Zephyr with the lead now. Yeah, Zephyr uh, using those disjoints very well against Ness. That's a really great you know way to do it because Ness loses to most swords. And honestly, I think Zephyr's kind of caught on to like Zerum's little uh, oh down B movement because he actually Back went up. in and shielded. Yeah, and Yoshi's story: small, small blast zones, very easy to kill early with that back throw. Yeah. Like that was a, like one one ten with good di, so it's like that. That's tough. That was oh no, the oh, air dodge. Okay. He can get back. He can get back, but no, he's got bunk it. Yeah, you got to bunk it, and then you can get back. Uh, that's tough. 
At least the side stage uh, isn't like PS2 or anything where it's like you can get trapped or pineapple underneath the stage. Alright, good punish. I cannot believe that. So that was a good punish, but he was so close to a shield break, and you know that Zerum wanted that. Like, he's Zerum will go for crazy things. He yeah. will, like, up your shield break. Exactly. Okay. Falling with a down air. Okay, how's what's the limit move? What's the limit move? It's how I'm kind of like just staying away. Like he's a respecter. Right? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, Whoa! Right into the climb hazard. Oh, the spike. Shielding that one. Okay, zero at one twenty percent. Clean one two three. Well, okay, yeah, yeah. The, the slant's not helping him right there with that with that down air spike. Yeah. He just can't get that. I, I was thinking I would like to see him go for that. Yeah, he just oh, he's dead. He can't. Oh, no, he had it. I, yeah, oh. Finally, so clutch. But it, can he stay alive regardless? Nice Probably not. All right, well. Okay. So, yeah, that's punishable, but it's good shield pressure. You just got to keep it rolling. You know, take 8% for it, but, you know, as long as you get more off of that, that that's worth it. Wow, and almost a full limit charge already. Plenty of time while Zerum was uh, flittering around off stage. Zerum has to respect the back air. He's trying to get in and shield. He does, he does. But he's been doing he's a great job of. Right yeah, he's doing a great job of uh, respecting the back air so far. Um, just because Ness has great aerial mobility and movement. I'm surprised Zephyr didn't go for a um, limit side B on, B on Yeah, side. it's like these are I don't know these are some of these are missed opportunities I feel, but it's hard to it's hard to call them out as they as they happen just because you never know what's going through a player's head what they're really trying to go for. Zerom needs to do some more, but he, I like how he's yeah he waited for his opportunity and now he's pushing it. Right, he's I mean he's got the lead. He's just got to roll with it Ooh, and gets so that strong. PK flash. He's literally laddering him. Yeah. And this is why, like I said, Zerum loves these triplats just because he can go for some of that stuff. Catching you on platform, especially with tech traces and stuff, he really goes for a lot of PK Flash and PK Thunder Cheese. Um, it works a lot. Okay, okay, yeah, that time the limit, yeah, you forgot that he had limit, you know? It's like you can't you can't remember that, that that doesn't trade with the PK Flash. It just goes right through it. The backer, though. Yeah, and 119.